Down in Adams County now, ice on bridges and roadways is just about like it is all over the rest of the state. Our 12 News Tao Ta is live in Natchez. Tao, what's going on? Well, Melanie, what with the sleet, snow, and freezing rain here in Natchez, folks are pretty much braving the cold to take in this winter wonderland with accumulations above two, four inches. Silver Street, DA Biplane, and Roth Hill in Natchez are currently closed. Now, power outages currently stand at approximately 300, according to Mississippi Power. Ashley Barnes is a Natchez native. She tells me it's expected of power outages in the rural area she lives, deciding to bunker down at a nearby hotel. Others traveled from out of state for Valentine's. Listen at the reaction to seeing the winter storm. Oh my God, no, this is something new for me. <laughs> this is the first. Winter Wonderland, I don't know. <laughs> Where's Santa? You know, uh, just, just, uh, just, just, well, maybe the last one is how am I going to get home? But I guess that'll be a couple of days. <laughs> Now, Stephen Gardner says he's extending his stay for a few more days as precaution before catching his flight back to Houston. Now, br brisk conditions will continue to dip as we head into the overnight hours. So just bundle up. I've got my scarf, uh, my gloves, my handy hand warmers in here as well. Health officials are just reminding long exposure to the cold can cause hypothermia. So be careful out there, you guys. Right now, live in Natchez, Tata, 12 News.